This is our Heart and Lung Dissection Lab by Stacy, Shannon, Claudia, and Emily. Here, this is a picture of our heart and lung before we dissected it. Yes, we did have a pericardium membrane and it is present around the heart. Here we are removing it and it looks sort of like fat, but we were able to remove it and it keeps the heart contained in the chest cavity and keeps the heart from over expanding when the blood volume increases. Here, Claudia is pointing to the diaphragm, which is in between the lungs, which felt sort of rubbery. Here, the lungs are pinkish reddish. No, the lungs have not been polluted because they are not shriveled and or black. Here, we are gently squeezing the lungs and they feel jelly and rubbery. Here is the trachea and we have the rings that go around it here and the rings are made up of cartilage. The trachea has rings to keep it open. The heart here is about the size of a baseball and the color of the heart muscle is dark purplish with a little bit of red and brown and it's covered in fat. Yes, we did see the liquid move inside. That's why there is some blood on the bottom of the tray. The coronary veins drain blood from the muscular tissue of the heart. Coronary arteries supply blood to the heart muscle. There are two blood vessels and they are called arteries and capillaries. Yes, there is a black jelly-like substance inside the ventricle and it is called platelets. Emily is poking her finger into the back of the lower chamber until it comes out at the top of the heart. This blood vessel is called veins. The left side of the heart has much more muscular than the right side because it has to do more work. Emily pushed her finger to the back of the ventricle until it pushed out of the top. She replaced her finger with the probe. The blood vessel that the straw is now in is the capillary. Here are the aortic valves. These shape in a circular form and their function closes and the mitral valve opens to allow blood to flow from the left atrium into the left ventricle. Here is the thick layer muscle between the ventricles. It's the septum and its function is it separates the left side of the heart from the right. 